And we do know that this storm brought down a lot of trees in East Nashville. That's where we sent News Channel 5's Olivia Michael, and she talked to a family that would have a much different story to tell tonight had they waited just a few more minutes to get to their safe place. So we looked out the front door, saw the hail. When we came back in, we could not see out the front window. Um, so that was the moment we decided we'd go to the basement. Amy Smith said she and her husband trusted their gut. Uh, my husband brought the dog down and said a tree just fell on our roof. I mean, it happened that fast. It was a decision that may have saved them from tragedy. We got a limb through my daughter's room, which is upstairs right now. So it punctured the roof and it's raining in her room a little bit right now. Now as the cleanup begins, reality sets in. It was scary because she was up there cleaning it about three minutes beforehand. So we're just thankful that she came downstairs. Oh, we're thankful she came downstairs. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Their home is also without power, but they say despite the damage, it could have been worse. The rest of our house is totally fine. So if that's the worst thing to happen, we are totally, we're fine. We're good. Smith encourages others to follow their instincts like she and her family did as storms like this one roll through. You know, we originally were not in the basement because it was supposed to just be a thunderstorm. And just, you know, there's always that instinct that kicks in that's like, this is not good. Uh, listen to it and seek shelter because you never know when a tree is going to go through your roof. <laughs> in East Nashville, Olivia Michael, News Channel 5.